Nightwing, let's go. Keeps us popping. Beast Boy Collect to Build Wave. This is figure number one, even though I'm reviewing it third. Nightwing. Now we've had some Nightwings before, but this one should be a little bit different. Let's find out. Got our bio card and a McFarland stand. Now, do not adjust your screen settings. The card is just that washed out. The color is very muted. Dick Grayson began his crime-finding career as the original Robin, Batman's protege and crime-finding partner. An expert acrobat and skilled fighter, Dick eventually left the nest and ventured on his own as a new hero called Nightwing. His childhood experiences as a circus acrobat and trapeze artist make him extremely agile. He is a superior fighter and a highly skilled martial artist who has been personally trained by Batman. Nightwing is a keen detective, a natural leader, and a strategist with advanced knowledge of a variety of technologies. He comes with Beast Boy's core body, and I am just now realizing that he has no accessories. What up with that? Face sculpt is okay. Don't know what artist they're basing this on, but kind of looks like the Joker to me a little bit. So what's really bothering me about this figure? Paint job is not that good. There are a lot of chips in this blue paint here where I can see straight through the black. The lines are not sharp and crisp. Same over here. But the big thing is these moth joints as I call them or butterfly joints or shoulder cups, whatever you want to call them, they look really stupid. They didn't paint them. So when you have them, when you have his arms set right to the side, and the cups are showing, there's a big gap in the blue which shouldn't be there. Like, look here, it looks like it's extending. Now, if this would come over, well, okay, I stand correct, I was say if it would come over and cover that gap, it still looks bad. They should have painted those cups blue on the top, or maybe the whole thing blue, or I don't know, but something to make it look better, but it makes the costume look really disjointed and ugly. Now, this ab piece, I think, is new. I don't, I don't think they used this on the other Nightwings. I'll check in a second. No thigh cut. An athlete like Nightwing should have a thigh cut and a calf cut. So this is one of the figures where I can't excuse McFarlane articulation. We've seen them do thigh cuts before on other figures. They could include it here. They do have that new calf covering. Appreciate that. The pins on the legs and arms. They're using the large ones that come flesh so they look a bit better. So not an awful figure, but way below expectations. 360 on the head. Good tilt left. Good tilt right. Down. Up. Arms get really high. Bug range excellent. Night wingspan good. Thought it'd be better with those butterfly cups. 360 at the shoulder. 360 at the bicep. 360 at the wrist. You can get vertical or horizontal motion with those wrist joints. Double jointed pinned elbows, keep the silly range. The torso rocker lets them lean a little bit. Rock a little bit. And roll a little bit, nice and smooth. Get a 360 with that abdominal joint. Maybe get a 360 at the waist, yep. Waist also leans. So combine the two, you can go a little bit further. Very little on the ab crunch. Nightwing way back is in full effect though. Underwear prevents a good lean, as well as preventing a good kick. Doesn't stop a circus split though. The flying braces. Fan damage all day. Double jointed pin knees do the job. Not a prancer because of those wonder draws. Totally a dance though, those toes are pointing all the way as far as they can in the right directions. A little bit of rocker action. And you get 360 at the ankles. There is no thigh cut, no calf or boot cut. Height clocks in at six and a half inches. Here is next to Red Hood and what I would say is a far superior Nightwing. And there he is next to Donna Troy and Raven. 
So what action figure had a lot of promise but then end up disappointing? Survey son! Nightwing. He's all right, good upper body articulation, but he's an acrobat. McFarlane Toys could have sprung for some thigh cuts there and helps out with the posing. He comes with no weapons. Mine is a sloppy paint job and those butterfly slash moth joints just aren't working for me. So overall, he's the weakest one of the waves so far. There's two, what, three Nightwings already out in this line that are better than this. They missed the mark here. I wish they'd done better. All right, sound off in the comments. Let me know, did you pick this guy up? Anticipating this guy. And I must say that in the package, I thought he was gonna be okay, but getting him out, he's a big disappointment in my book. But I could be wrong. Let me know in the comments, sound off, let's talk about it. Make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, turn on notifications, and as always, share a link with a friend that loves the plastic. Till next time, bootleg Nightwing is out of here.